What's up guys, Jake Sleesman, Blue Collar Fitness, and today we're going over the light version, Gorilla Bow. Is it worth it? What are the differences? All things Gorilla Bow light. Stay tuned. If you haven't seen my original Gorilla Bow, I have a bunch of workouts. I uh, wouldn't say a bunch, but I have really good workouts on the channel, and I went over why I purchased a Gorilla Bow in the first place back when COVID first hit. It was an awesome tool once the gyms closed, and it still has remained in my fitness arsenal. Now that I have my girlfriend, I wanted to have something that we could have over here, uh, smaller to fit where we can work out with it, and plus I wanted to have two to be able to work out together with the Gorilla Bows how I like to work out, which is high intensity. It doesn't really matter if we're using free weights, Gorilla Bow, it doesn't matter. I like keeping the heart rate high. Now this right here, this is the Gorilla Bow Light. This is in green. Some of the features that are different between the light and the full is the diameter of the actual Gorilla Bow is half an inch less in diameter than the full. So I actually really like this for curls because you can get that nice grip and actually supinate. I really like it. Also, it's nine inches shorter from tip of the claw to tip of the claw. It's a lot lighter, but with that, you only have one grip, not two. So this way you can do less weight. I believe it's like, it's roughly half the weight of what you can do with the original, you can do with this. But I'm telling you right now, that's not a big influence. Because with the resistance, the reason why it's nice is you can have all these different weights. We have, this isn't even all the stuff we have. We have a ton. I mean, you could put, like this right here is a 90 pound short band. Uh, it's, it's, there's a lot of resistance there. I mean, that's a lot. So you can have pretty much whatever weights you're looking for and take up no space. That's the whole point of this. Say you're someone that you can't afford a gym membership or you don't have time. This option right here, if you got a small apartment, whatever, it doesn't really matter if you like working out outside, this is an awesome option. I mean, it's cheaper, plus you have all these weights. Now to use it, this is a 50 pound band. It's really easy. Uh, just locks right in and I always just flip it and that's where this one's a lot nicer than the original uh, for ease I mean you can just kind of put it like that and there you go you're sniping just kidding so really right there you have 50 pounds of resistance in all honesty when you're benching I mean you're not gonna feel it till you get out further I have a couple tips on how to increase the resistance for your chest but if you're looking for something that you can just have on hand doesn't take up a lot of space I mean we have 100 pound bands in here I have four 90 pound short bands I have a ton of bands in this and I have bands in this so I mean the whole gym all the weight we could possibly need for my girlfriend is right here so I mean that's it so if you don't have limited space this is a really nice option plus you can work out outside now what I want to do is I'm going to start getting the Gorilla Bow fired back up, uh, do a bunch of workouts with it, all that fun stuff with the old Gorilla Bow. I wanna try out a couple different other options that are kind of similar, same idea with resistance bands and at home gyms per se. I'm gonna start doing a lot more of that because I, fitness is something that I care about very, very much. I mean, I think a lot of this world's problems with stresses and obesity and all that it can just, it could be handled with a higher outlook of fitness. Now, actually we were just, we just got a new scale and a new device to track. I was helping my girlfriend set up the scale and the other thing that she's testing. I still have my Fitbit, she's testing the other. I was helping her set that up and it considered frequent exercise to be three hours a week. And that kind of shocked her. And I tried to tell her, it's almost ungodly how many people do not get the exercise in a week. And I know times are tough, but working out is one of the best things to keep your mental state healthy. Keep focused on your goals, reduce stress, 
just all around feel better. Is it all about making them huge gains? No, it's not. I mean, I love seeing progress. I, I have to work out. I'm a bad man. If I don't, it's not good. So I have to work out. My focus on it is it keeps me keeps me driven. It keeps me focused on what I want with BCO, life, in the gym, my diet, my girlfriend, all that. It keeps me focused on what matters, keeps all the, the BS that we see all the time gone. That's why I focus so highly on working out. And as of right now, my girlfriend and I are going to focus more on nutrition because we both kind of slacked away from it. And uh, we want to get back on track on our goals. We're going to help hold our ch each other accountable for it. So it's going to be a great journey. And we're going to film all that, how we do it, testing a bunch of stuff on the fitness channel. A proper fitness plan, you want to keep as many different options in there. I would not want to just have resistance bands or free weights. I think a combination of both is the optimal plan, especially well, actually, really for every body part, I really like mixing it up, changing it up. And it's really nice to be outside when it's nice like this, getting a nice sweat in, get a nice bicep pump, you know, get after it. I'm not saying you have to subscribe. I'm not saying you got to like videos or, you know, even comment. But it would be nice to see you guys jump over, share your fitness goals, your journey, what you like to do weight-wise, how often you work out, your supplements, your diet. All that fun stuff, just share it. It's the same thing as the outdoor channel, just with fitness. But I'm fixing to get a little bicep burner in. Time to get a little pump. The boys is in, uh, actually we got a wing night tonight, so we're all getting together, going over, have some wings. So I'm pretty excited about that. Drink some water, eat some chicken wings. It's gonna be a good day. But I gotta get a bicep workout in real quick. If you wanna see that video, it'll be on the fitness channel. Guys, this is Jake Slees in Blue Collar Outdoors. This is the Gorilla Bow Light. Just a quick overlook. It's time to grind. Time to bump out some, some biceps quick because I ain't got much time before chicken wings. As always, guys, smash thumbs up button for your boys. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. We do have some older videos. Go back and watch the old ones laugh together with us because they're bad. You can see how far we've come just by going over there. It's all humbling, man life's a journey you got to love every second of it you're never great at something from the start never let that deter you from progressing to what you can be mentally because guys at the end of the day we can do whatever we want in this world we could be whatever we want if we have goals you have a vision and you're disciplined in it you got the work ethic baby you can do whatever you want i promise you that but guys it's time to do some biceps we'll catch you on the next one